McKinstry. It is gone! Up and out. Zach's got wheels and headlong in. It's a two-out triple. There's a picture of me about two years old in a diaper carrying around a plastic wiffle ball bat. Baseball was always my number one. I had die, die hard baseball guy. One player that I really looked up towards is my brother. He was always one step ahead of me, so I would just watch him play. In high school, I would go to his games in college and I'd keep book and make sure I was locked in on the games, uh, watching what they were doing, the little things, backing up bases, cutoffs, all that good stuff. My father, he was a school teacher, a baseball coach, and just kind of distilled like all those uh, coaching aspects into me early, like don't talk back to your coaches, make sure you're running all the time, doing the right things. I was a quiet student, uh, didn't talk much in class, just got my work done, did my thing, and uh, just kind of kept my head down. Yeah, all the fun was at home and then work was work, so uh, that's kind of how I lived my life and uh, he's definitely a big role model for that. I took Spanish class in eighth grade and all the way through high school and then double A, they had a really good Spanish teacher, English teacher, um, that would come to the field and he uh, would help me out with some of the vocabulary stuff. For professional reasons with baseball and just have a little bit of understanding of their culture, like you learn their language and you learn, it comes with everything. You learn the culture, um, why they talk that way, like the different dialects that they use. Uh, I thought it was really cool. CMU offered me basically right at the end of my sophomore year uh, a full ride to go and play at their university and I looked at my dad, he's a school teacher, and my mom, she's been bouncing around jobs and it just made sense financially for us and for me personally to go to a smaller university. Their shortstop was leaving that year so I had a good opportunity to step in there and uh, be the shortstop that first year. I loved it, um, loved every minute of Central Michigan. 33rd rounder made it to the big leagues, beat the odds, it was really cool. Just keep working hard, do all the right things, keep your head down and listen to your parents.